love this part. It's my favorite story. <laughs> hey, hey there. Welcome to Face to Face Fridays. I'm your host, Sean Friday. Hope you enjoy it. This is from Creed Borden, and he asks, where do you guys see yourselves in the future? How big do you hope to get? We, yeah, we would love to be big. I think a headlining tour would be the next step. It would be pretty big for us. Um, around the States, headlining. I think for all of us, we, that's definitely a thing that we're working on, you know? We want to own the city. <laughs> we built the city on rock and roll. Being, being able to headline like bigger clubs, like over a thousand Sell capacity. Out, dude. <laughs> <laughs> and then playing, I don't know, stadiums. Being a world famous big rock and roll band. We built this city on rock and roll. <laughs> this is from Daryl Newman. We all know Daryl. We all know him. Are you for real? What's this question, Dan? Yeah, you know him, buddy. Damn right I do. Any chance we'll see the debut LP and or the airport? Oh, oh okay. <laughs> Any chance we'll see the debut LP and or the airport sessions EP pressed on vinyl? Airport sessions the EP, EP pressed um, on vinyl. We haven't really thought about that, but I would yeah. say the LP um, for sure. We wanted Absolutely. to do a limited edition. Um, uh, well, I guess we're working on it. We're doing like a thousand copies, so it's gonna be like slim pickings. That's yeah. A lot of people have asked, so I really want one. Get to thinking about it. Me I want too. One for myself. Me too. So bad. Me too. Yeah. But the EP, never even thought about it. This is from Alegria C at Happy Life Twenty One. She sounds so depressed, dude. Any advice to someone who's trying to have the belief that they can pursue their music? Integrity. Yeah. Just no com and compromising is a bad thing. Don't listen to. It's hard, but yeah, like others' negative yeah. input. Naysayers. Yeah, just saying just, it can't be done, etc. Et yeah, do what you want to do and keep at it and play with other people. Work hard. Don't want to do it. Yeah, it's a big thing too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is from Jen Vesp. Oh, Jen. Oh, do, Jen. Of course we know her. <laughs> <laughs> do any of you have pre-show routines slash rituals? If so, what might they be? Oh, and hi, by the way. Happy face. Hi, Jen. Hi, Jen. Jen. Pre-show rituals. Um, I do warm-ups. I don't. Nobody else does. No? Occasionally, no. I'll grab a guitar and yeah. noodle around, but nothing. Occasionally, I'll... Rituals, though. Do some rudiments. What are rudiments? I don't know. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll, I'll, I'll practice drumstick patterns. We all kind of like before a show, we'll drumstick decide what patterns. the set list is. That's kind of a ritual. Oh, yeah. We do. We don't ever really know till we go on and. We write it out. Yeah. That's what we've been doing. You yeah. just sit yeah. there writing it all up. Mm -hmm. We write out the set list. Even though it's the same. Last three nights, so write it up. Because, mm -hmm. forget. <laughs> There's no real, like, like we don't say, like, a little cheer or anything like that. A cheer? Or we'll do, like, a prayer cheer. or something. Or a prayer or a pre-show shot of Jaeger or anything like that. All right, this is by Justin Bowersox. He asks, um, which songs do you wish you could have written before the original artist and why not cover it, slash, them? Oh, there's so many good ones. Yeah. yeah. Like, what so what song, man. from all three guys, what song do you wish you wrote that someone else wrote? There's a lot. I know, there's a fucking lot. There's so many. Any, um, like, Credence Clearwater Revival song I wish I wrote? It's Fortunate Son, especially. Mine is uh, Born on a Bayou. That Prince song that wrote for Sinead O'Connor, um, what is the name of it? Nothing compares to you. Oh, no, it's yeah. an amazing song. It's a great one. Like, fuck. 
What's That's that? my definition of a perfect song. What's that Adele you know? song with the piano? Oh, no, somebody uh, something. Someone I want. So so. Uh, that song is amazing. What is it? From beginning to end. Such a good. It's song. a perfect song. So, anything could happen by Ellie Goulding. <laughs> Just because I'm hooked oh, yeah. on that song right now. <laughs> what a great song. Olga Garcia asks, can't stop listening to these three songs from Dead Sarah. Any chance of a re-release of At Seven, Maggie, Innuendo? Oh, Dude. wow. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> you are digging deep, Maggie. <laughs> I love At Seven. Uh, yeah, At Seven. At Seven is an awesome song. How you should it, do oh, At I'm Seven. Sorry. Go ahead. How did they, yeah, how, how did you find find those? How did you find those? Are they still on MySpace? It is the internet. No. No. Reverb. Reverb Nation. Reverb Nation? They're not up there either. Oh. Ooh, you know what? They could be on like YouTube somewhere. Is Maggie YouTube. the one that goes? Yeah. Bang, 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 <laughs> Who would you tour with and where? Dead or alive? Dead or alive or just anyone? No, or I just think it's anyone. mother friggin' alive. All right. I, I don't know, he says if you are one dream tour consisting of yourself and three other bands. Three other bands. I like to put Rage on there just to get the yeah. fire. Yeah. Zeppelin? Yes. And Zeppelin, those are my two that I thought of. To get, yeah. And, and three. us headline? Three. And us and oh, one three. more. I said those are no, the two that I One, Chod. And three more. Listen to me, buddy boy. It says, Yourselves and three other bands. I know, and I said I. I but if we're to. talking dead, like then I would maybe not do range, and I would put like the Beatles on or something, just so I could see the Beatles every night. No, Zeppelin every fucking night. Well, Zeppelin, of Zeppelin, course. Yeah. Zeppelin, Rage, <sighs> Nirvana. Yeah. Or Pearl Jam. Or at the drive-in. Fuck. Yeah. Or, oh, yeah. or refused. Refused. Actually, and then Outreach. There's this band. There's this, Outreach. Uh, kind of this. Uh, Kind of underground band, it's a Rockland, Rockland County hardcore band from New York uh, called Outreach. Go look them up. Find their music, start to promote it again, like get it this out of the internet again. Out. Please, please do, no, and don't edit this out. Yeah. <laughs> edit it. No. Leave it. The singer yeah, is right there. Yeah. We're Outreach! Oh, no. Great <laughs> singer over there. Uh, excuse me if I got your name wrong. Charlie Charbonu? Charbonu? Asks. Which song do you enjoy playing live more? Face to Face or Dear Love? And am I allowed to crowd surf to either? Dear Love and yes. Face to Face? Ask, ask, tell, yeah. For yeah. sure. I mean, right now, we're not really playing Dear Love right now, but it's all, it's a, we all like to play it. Mm -hmm. but, um, mm -hmm. Face to Face, we're just really used to playing live, and you can fucking crowd surf anytime you want, man. Agreed. That was a good question. I liked it. It was different. Thanks, Charlie.